And okay, guys. So I, I oh, okay. I may have made it worse, but I've tried to fix it. Um, hopefully this will make it better. But it does seem as though the uh, stream is starting to get a little bit unstable. So if at any point in the future you do find it slow down a little bit, uh, please make sure you refresh your stream just so you can make sure you're up to date. Hopefully it won't be too bad if it does get really bad. So guys, keep me. Tell me if it does get bad. If it does get bad. Uh, please tell me, and we'll I have to end the stream early today. Um, we'll wait and see. Hopefully it doesn't go too badly. I would like to make the High Lordship at least by the end, before we have to end the stream, but yeah. My liege, Lord Paramount Craig and Stark has tried to have Lord Gowin not of Arendelle arrested, but failed to apprehend him, so he's now raised his uh, place in rebellion. What a great fight. Bad news from Bell Island, the population having trouble, that's fine. We probably lost a few people during that whole thing. I do apologize, nothing I can really do about it sometimes. Sometimes things are dumb, but yeah. Salt Cliffs, okay. Don't think, I can't, I mean, I could try and get this land from uh, Craig and Stark, possibly. But what is this? Revolt against the rule? Yeah, we already had that, but what is this then? The Iron Throne Civil War to Lower Crown Authority, ah. So, Jason Lannister has seen an opportunity to lower the, the crown's authority. He's got the Reach on his side. He's got the High Septon. He's got the North on his side, the Riverlands, the Ironborn. And a lot of smaller lords have joined him. And no one's on the side of Jaehaerys Targaryen. And he's currently wounded. Well, there we go. Another war. Oh, the Tullys, though, have joined a side. The Vale has joined the King. Oh yeah, the Tullys did join this side. So we've got the Vale and the Red Wine family. They're the only King supporters right now. But yeah. That's a shame. Uh, weak claims, Hollow for Blackwood. We need new councils, the Nestral. Uh, Moore's Burley. Should we go for Burley? Let's go for Moore's Burley. He can be the Sinestral. My hand right now. We will improve defense. Of these lands. Anything else we can do? No, I just need to wait for that claim. We just need to get the claim. Come on, Justice Sir. Alaric Woods. You can do it. You, I know you can do it. Travels bring rumors of fire and blood. They say that Sir Joshua... Sir Joshua... Just a, a low... Look at this. Just a low-born boy. Sir Joshua has taken a dragon and Tyraxis. How did he do this? He's a skilled fighter. He's a giant. Did, like, was his mother a secret Targaryen? Is this a secret Targaryen right here, guys? <gasps> what is this? <laughs> How did he do this? How did he do it? Oh, well, I guess we'll never know. Uh, but Craig and Stark has taken his men down south, and I'm leading men. I'm g Remember, I'm a commander now, so Fionn Mormont is going to go down south to fight in this war. We're at 34% already. There are some I get along with quite well. I become friends with Benjen Holham, the Lord of Mount Moat Kaelin. Knight the Child. Knight the Child? Turning colder. I, well, you want me to knight my son? My son's dumb. He's an idiot. He hasn't even had a. He hasn't even had, you have two babies. He had one baby. He had one baby. She's still not. She's not even pregnant right now. It's ridiculous. Um, was beheaded. Why are my kids always so bad at having babies, guys? Why? Um, look at that. The Iron Fro. <laughs> look at that. King's Landing was taken straight away. He had to give up. He gave them more authority. Well, there we go. And he's been placed in jail by Cassidy Rock. Okay. So, jaehaerys has been placed in jail. Don't know what they're going to do with him. He's cr Apparently, he's a lunatic. Apparently, he's wounded. So this whole, he's just got, he's gone crazy. The people don't trust him. So they put him in jail for his own safety in the realm's safety. What is this? What is going on right now? Huh. Please don't talk about beef jerky. I, you're making me hungry, guys. I love beef jerky. Bad news from Bell Island. Efforts to squeeze taxes was not good. And I've got abdominal pains. No. Help me, Maester Ufa. You're a good maester, and you're strong. Maester Oof insisted that you'd feel much better if your humors were restored to their proper balance. I'm not sure that did anything, though. And... Oh, what? This, is this what we agreed to? 
He was beheaded by Jason Lannister. Okay, well, Jaehaerys Je Targaryen they felt was too dangerous for the realm. He was too crazy to be kept alive. He had no kids. His wife's not pregnant. And there you go. So the new king is King Mela, his brother. Trained fighter. Um, the regent is Florian Macy. And he's in jail with Jason Lannister. Would the Lannister kill him as well? Curse his name. Curse the name. Abdominal pain? He's pregnant. I'm not pregnant. I've gained vomiting though. Hmm, that's actually kind of funny. Vomiting would also be pregnancy. Vomiting would also be a pregnancy. So that's a... Uh, huh. <laughs> Maybe I am pregnant. Developing the scourge very well. I'm glad I hired him. There we go. He actually did something. He actually did something. Please get the claim before I die. Please get the claim. Come on. And they had a baby. Alwyn Mormont. My sister. 44 years old. She had a baby. Congratulations. Congratu- And I have cancer. Oh, great. Great. Now, I'm paranoid. So I won't completely- Even though I'm ruthless and ambitious, I don't completely trust him. Because I'm paranoid, so... Yeah, as long as you don't know what you're doing. Yeah, as long as he knows what he's doing, I think he'd go for that. Because he wants to be cured by any means, but he doesn't completely trust him. But I do feel better. There we go. Hopefully, that'll keep our cancer okay. Uh, deep. No, um, you know, at the moment, I got cancer. I'm not really well right now. Okay. We'll, we'll witness. We'll watch. We won't fight, though. We won't fight, but we will watch. Um, how's this? Sene our new Senestrial. How about my son? Andrew Mormont. My son will take over the position. Defenses. Cancer, pregnant, same thing. I'm not sure if that is the same thing. I'm not sure you know what pregnancy is. <laughs> or maybe you don't know what cancer is. I don't know. One of the two you're not sure, I think. Uh, we'll go for struggle for her. She's good at fighting. Those two won. We need a new position. Spy Master. We'll go with Danny, my sister. She could be the new Spy Master. Ah. So. After many hours of intense battle, only Sir Benfred Wells and Jorman Dustin remained in the field. Again, guys, if you do find there's a little bit of lag, please make sure you refresh. I can see it is unstable right now. Uh, pitiful state of my daughter. No, Winifred. Don't ruin my alliance with the Boltons. Don't you dare. We need them. We need one more place to get. Though I do have quite a lot of men myself. So I suppose we would be okay even without the Boltons, but still, we want to keep it for now. Can I join a faction? I guess I can't... Can I join the Liege Loyalist faction? Yeah, okay. Let's join the Liege Loyalist faction. Done. Um, we like them. You know, we like the North. We're zealous and stuff, you know. Oh, and looks like the stream is actually getting healthier again. There we go. That's perfect. Actually, the stream's actually got healthier again. So there you go, guys. That does not usually happen to us. So that's good to see. Hopefully that continues. Okay, just please don't die before we get the claim. We're so close, Fion. We're so close. Lord Fionn, after listening to your advice of a group of my bannermen, led by Lord Paramount Craig and Stark of the North, I hereby release the Kingdom of the North and all realms from their obligations to my person, granting them independence. What? 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 King Mela, who has been imprisoned by Jason Manister, has been forced, I guess, to sign this treaty by Craig and Stark, releasing the North. He released the North peacefully and the Westerlands. So the Westerlands and the North have both been released peacefully because Jason Lannister had the king. What a play this is. And he still has him in jail. What a play this was. There we go. The King of the Rock, Jason Lannister. Well, there we go. King Jason. And when we get a King of the North, brothers in arms, we got castle is my brother in arms where's the king in the north where's my king in the north why are you still a lord paramount oh because you got the peasant revolt maybe 
I'm assuming that's what it is. Wish he'd release everything and destroy the army. That would have been amazing. If he had released everything, that would have been crazy. Uh, winter fell of a trial by combat. Orfros Flint was deemed bad because Hofenori defeated his champion, Horfrost Flint. Okay, so you named your own son after you. No, not your son. Your... That is your son. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Very odd, very odd situation this is. But we got independence. We got Dawn. We got the Rock. And now we have the North. All independent. The world's a dangerous place. Someone's trying to kill my son. And they haven't released him yet. The heir would be Prince Urion, who's actually in the... He actually lives in the Rock. He actually lives in the Rock. <laughs> and all hail his grace, King Kragen Stark of the North. The King in the North. The King in the North. We have it, guys. Independence. The Dance of Dragons has completely led to the end of the Iron Throne as we knew it. Uh, lots of places are still underneath the Iron Throne, but how long will that last? That's a question we need to think about. Um, she likes diplomacy, money, and intrigue. Thrift, then, kind of stealing and stuff, money. I could go with that. I'm tired. I'm going to go to bed. Night, everybody. Good night, Mirian. Hope to see you next time. And I know I will, because I can always rely on you. He was hanged. Oh, dear. My work, yes, has come to fruition. Guys, we got it. Breakstone will be mine. Now, we're going to get rid of you. And I'm going to make you make a claim. On the woods, yes. Um, that'll be our next one, but let's go. Let's go in DD. Can we get any of her alliances? Locks? No. Okay, fine. He has 1,000 men. Wait. Oh, yeah, he's underneath him. That's fine. The king might tell me to take down my war. So we need to go in straight away and get it as quickly as possible, I think, is the best thing for us to do. We got our men. Andrew Mormont is known as the Red Bear. Andrew Red Bear. <laughs> why? I don't know why he's called the Red Bear. Not sure why that is. Hmm. And this is Hills. Not as good as other things, but still. When will you get the 19th of November, the 8th of November. That's good then. These guys get their first. Do we need commanders? No. Okay. I will lead the men in. These guys will come after. And we'll get the Boltons to come join me. Oh, we have no... You don't have an alliance with me right now? What are you doing? Stupid thing. Okay. Now, call to arms. Join me. Join us in the war. Join us in the battle. Honor the obligations. Did we win? We just won. There we go. Quentin Whirl, we captured. So we actually captured one of the Whirls. Who had obviously, you know, left their lands. You know, Quent, no, it's Quent the Whirl. So we beat Whirl twice. I feel bad for him. I feel bad for him. Uh, but yes, let's take this then. And then we'll have our high lordship. Let him rot. Yes. Yes, yes, I'm a rough man. He's an enemy. Red Bear is a good name. Execute him. News from Casterly Rock. Prince Urien has actually been able to tame Arcone. Arcone. I'm going to go for Arcone, like Archon. We'll go for that. How many men are here? 500 men. Quickly, before Craig and Stark tells us to take down our men, the wild dragon cannibal who's known to attack smaller dragons and has been reported that recently he emerged from his lair and he attacked his cousin Grey Ghost. And he killed it. Grey Ghost was killed by cannibal. Well, there you go. Well, there you go. That's... uh. The end of that, I guess. Come on, bring... Yes, bring your men in. We can assault. It's done. And we're finished. Enforce my demands. And there you have it, guys. We have taken the land. We have our own High Lordship of the North Clans. It is mine. Everyone will know the Mormont lame. The Mormonts rise. The Mormonts rise in the North. And uh, anything else we can do? Melee. Domain too big. Okay. Now, we need to give away some of these things because we have too many. 
We have too many. We have four out of two. So we need to give away some places. Now, my son is my only heir. And the others, yeah, I don't... They're, they're, they're married to other people. We can give it, though, to these guys. These guys have supported us this whole time. And obviously, they're married to my family. So I kind of like that. Um, the other sister as well. He was the one who got us the title. So I feel like giving land to these two is what I should do. So, yeah. Um, how about... Which two are the weakest? We've got a large northern keep there. Small one. Okay. Large northern keep. I like this as a small one, but it's a rank three. This seems kind of weird. Of course we're going to keep this. I think you give away Breakstone Hill. It's the furthest one away. And I keep one of these two. 1,000, like 600, 600, 400. Maybe we keep Crow's Edge. And we give away these two, I think. Yeah. Give it to the wall. I'm not going to give it to the wall. Congratulations, sir. It will go to our family anyway, so yeah. Um, give it to a wall. Big Stone Hill. There you go. You got us these lands. Congratulations, Woods family. You get Breakstone Hill. Let's, let's have a look who else is in the court then. Who else is in our court then? Um, Blackwoods, Mormonts. We've got Wall, but he's not. He's actually with the Not family, so technically he's not with us. So I probably wouldn't do that. Yeah, it wouldn't work out very well. Let's just go for the other guy, Master of Arms. Congratulations, Pines End for you. Okay, there we go. Done and dusted. And um, we can make a new Spy Master. We'll go with Donal. Or Marissa. Let's go for Donald. He'll like us once we put him in a position there. There we go. He likes us a bit there. The others are done. Now we can actually push our ducal claims. We can try and take over these two. So we could probably go for Dejure Wars. I wish, you know, I wish the king would give me my vassals though. I want him to give it to me. Maybe I could ask him. Is there a way to ask him to give me the people that I want? The people are meant to be mine. Make our own kingdom. Take a loan. For now, though, we're going to be good to the Starks. We like the Starks right now. Um, we'll let time go by. I declared revolt against the rule of Lord Paramount Harold the Fat. Harold the Fat has transferred the vast. There we go. He gave the vast. He gave me Nori. I thought he might. Well, there we go. I thought he might. That's why I didn't want to declare war just yet. It was given us the Norries. So we got Lord Hofer the Nori. He's now my vassal. He wants to make me a commander. Good to see. All we need is that one. And he gave me also Joseph Knott. So no wars needed, guys. We got our high lordship. Perfect. That's exactly what I wanted to see. If we can get claims then on obviously Deepwood, we can connect our lands. Be much better. Ah, uh, 2,900 men. And uh, yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy. Good night to you. Make a bear king. Maybe we could. Advisor. We see we've risen up so much. He now wants to make me an advisor to the, the North. The Kingdom of the North. Now that we're a free kingdom. I'm now the advisor as well. During this visit to my court, the Justice of Arendelle tried to get me to like his liege lord. Oh, well, well. Great Melee, Karstarks. This is beneath me right now. We just took over some lands, you know. We're a powerful bear family now. You know, we're just like you and the others. Don't look down upon us. Take Iron Raff. Take the grove. <laughs> Take the forester lands. Torgan Forester. Refused the revocation of Castle of Drunkard's Tower. But what do we do now? Yeah, I guess we just get more claims. There's a king of the north, though, guys. There's a king of the north. King Harl Hornblower Varro Wolf. My liege. It worked. Castle. Well, use it, yeah. We've now got a claim on a uh, deep wood. So we've now got a claim on deep wood. Now, he has 2,800 men. I have 3,000 men. We could probably take him on. But obviously, our men would be separated. But we also have the Boltons. So, guys, we could attack the Glovers, take deep wood, and connect our lands together. Would be kind of nice. What do we need to create a, a kingdom? We need two duchy titles. So, if we were independent and two duchy titles, you know, if we weren't for independence, like, I don't think Theon 
Uh, he is ambitious, though. Maybe he would. Maybe he wants them to be. He appreciates, he respects and appreciates the Starks, but he remembers back in the old, old days where there were many kings of the north. And he does have a son now, Prince Ben Stark. There you go. Well, well, well. We'll, we'll give it a little bit of time. Then we'll go for that. Um, what about that? Okay, nothing there. What should I get you to do? Improve relations. Wait, do my vassals like me? Yes, yes, no, no. Okay, let's get the vassals to like us then. Improve relations with the Norris, I think, first. There we go. What have the Glovers ever done except die? That is... The Glovers are actually a pretty decent family. And if you've watched a TV show, they're being played by a great actor, which makes me happy. I love that actor. He's a good actor. I mean, obviously, the Glover may not be good in the show, but the actor who plays him is a good actor, you know, in other shows. Ah... If you don't know Blackadder, you're missing out. King of Mela Targaryen has finally been released by the Lannisters. And he's put himself as the King of the Iron Throne. What will happen to the Rock? The Rock and the North must ally together. It may be the only way to keep our independences. Could be the only way, guys. Or factions. Everyone's a loyalist, you know. The Starks gave us independence. They brought this kingdom. They gave us independence through their factions and strategy. Blackadder is absurdly wonderful. I think Blackadder is possibly the best sitcom ever made. Um, if you consider season two and onwards. I think it's possibly the best sitcom ever made. I remember when there was a, there was a, a vote in England for the best British sitcom ever. And it came second. Uh, losing to Only Fools and Horses. Now, I think that's a bit unfair because Only Fools and Horses at the time was still very... I had fond memories. A lot of people, I think, you know, the 90s, Only Fools and Horses was massive. And the vote was, like, in 2000. So I think it was kind of a bit unfair. I think Blackadder is better, actually, as a comedy. But yes, the Council Lord Roderick stepped in as you were about to make a fool out of yourself. He was able to argue for your point, not only saving your face, but also winning the argument for you. It is obvious that Roderick's smooth talking was the sole reason for your success. Ooh, thank you, Roderick the Ruin. Keep look, keeping an eye on Fionn Mormon. That's kind of nice to see. Thank you. I truly owe you. Bah. I would have had that argument by myself. Yeah, I think he's a bit rough. There. He's like, tuh. I've had that argument myself. Don't, Dustin, don't you watch out for me. I can handle things myself. I don't need you. I don't need you or anyone. No crown yet. So the king still doesn't have a crown. He just wears nothing. Um, Del Boy fell through the bar. <laughs> And my son had a son, Medgar Mormont. There we go. Like, you know, I'm not saying uh, Only Fools and Horses is bad. Only Fools and Horses was very good. Um, but Blackadder, I think, is a better made. It's a smarter comedy, personally. But yeah, it's just my opinion. Just my opinion. Uh, marry a drag Mormont to a Targaryen. We might. Like I say, for now, it's going to keep things as they are. We're going to try and play as we would. Maybe my son's children might. But I'm trying to think what we might do for the, the far future. Now we've got the High Lordship. Do we try and become kings of the North? Or do I try and make our own kingdom? It would depend who we are, obviously. Fionn, we're trying to roleplay, obviously. If you're new to my channel, I tend to like to roleplay. Fionn Mormon, I feel like he's... But now he's ambitious, so he, he's going to want more. But he's not going to live long. His son, though, is gregarious, chaste, content, and glutton. So he'd probably be a good vassal. Possibly. We'll have to wait and see. As you replace your training done with a real person, you find that facing an intelligent enemy is a lot harder, but also more rewarding. Benjamin Holham. Thank you. Good fighting. Good fighting indeed. Hello, NG. Who are we playing as this week? We're playing as Theon Mormont during the Dance of Dragons. And uh, things have gone interestingly. Um, the Dance of Dragons have led to the Rock and the North both getting independence. And a lot of dragons have been killed. And Nettles married uh, Grover Mormont. <laughs> when did the North gain independence? Uh, basically, the King of the Iron Throne was imprisoned by the Lannisters. And then the Lannisters and Craig and Stark made a faction for independence. They forced it upon the King because he was imprisoned. And he had to accept. Travers bring rumors of fire and blood. They say that Alyssa Valerian now rides sea smoke. What happened to the former owner? Was it Damien Vallette? No, it wasn't him. 
not Corley's. Lena. No, he, he was murdered. Okay, this guy. He died of an infected wound. Oh, Adam Valerian. What a sad, sad day. What a sad day. Shadowmoor's been a success. The Shad Yeah we go. The Norries like us a little bit more. Let's get the Norries to like us. Let's get them all to love me. We have 3,200 men. Not looking too bad. The North Clansmen support the bears. The North Clansmen and the bears. Okay, King beyond the wall. The Lord Commander should be able to handle it most likely. 3,800 men. Yeah, I don't know, maybe. He might have a trouble if that does happen. So hopefully you'd think the North would go to help. Uh, a traveling poet who calls himself a bard arrived today. A good for nothing no I don't think he'd be fond of the bard. He'd be like, get away from me. Stupid bard singing, being stupid, you know. Tch. Who cares about them? Who cares about the bards? Uh, hold him, Ailey. We're fine for now. Do you have any more kids? 42, probably not. Probably going to keep it just that one kid. Very young, though. Could be a chance to get a regency here. How old is he? Oh, he's only 37. Kragen Stark is really young. I forgot how young he was. Lionel the young Tyrell. He's finally grown up. Little Tyrell has finally grown up. The Shield Islands. I appreciate the years of law service you've given on my council. However, I'm afraid the time has come for your responsibility to come to an end. I hereby name in... Alyssa Wallace, the new advisor. What? What? You're making the world the advisor? How dare he? No, how dare he? Yeah, I'm angry with him. Your position on the council, this is display. Yeah. How dare he? I am the Mormont. I am a Mormont. My acquaintance, Lord Wallace Glover, has tried to have Lord Roderick's Woods of Wolfswood arrested. Okay. So the woods, they try to have their lands taken away from them. This could be a good time to attack the Glovers. Even with blunt blades, a train and fight is a dangerous thing. I've gained wounded. That's not good. Let's attack them now then. Let's take it while they're weak. My small council, should I attack them? Take deep wood? They're, they're fighting amongst themselves. I can bring the Boltons in as well. And us both together should be able to take them down. But obviously the king could ask me to hold back. But then again, why do I care about the king? He betrayed me. He betrayed me. I can't believe it, Craig and Stark. You betrayed me. I thought we were friends. I thought you finally were looking at me with respect. But let's go. Maybe in future we will try. You know, I'm, I'm obviously slightly annoyed. You know, our guy is an ambitious man, you know. And he's ruthless. He wants respect. So he's not happy with the fact of how he's been treated with by the Stark. So that might affect what he does. We need a new commander, though. We need a couple more. Alaric Woods and Joseph Knott. Yeah, we'll go for Joseph Knott. We have some factions. I can't do a faction, actually, of course. Um, there are some liege loyalists for us. 200 men are going there, but they're going to be attacked. Of course, he'll honor his obligations. Advisor. Oh, okay, he wants to give me back my advisor position, guys. Well, there you go. <laughs> he wants to give it back to me. I, I think we can do that. Favor decline. Okay, I'm fine with that. Yeah, maybe we're happy now. But Jason Lannister, the one who made all this possible, has just died of severe stress. And his son, King Lorian Lannister, a formidable fighter, but he is crazy, has taken over. He's married to a Tyrell girl. Well, there you go. It's too bad when you go independent, you can't get your crowns from the Targaryens. That would have been a nice little thing. But yeah, this is a good time to attack. Perfect. No, don't go that way. We've got a scar. There we go. We've got a nice scar to show how great we are. Um, please, NG. What is it, Team Plasma? I owe nothing. What is it, Team Plasma? What is it, Team Plasma Grunt? I did not see what you wanted. 3,000 men. Put them over here. And will take deep wood for myself. Is he leading the men? No, he's not. He's actually in Winterfell. To admit he's actually on the council. Um, that's what the kappa is for. He's actually in Winterfell doing his... He's on the council. Yeah, bloody council. Put our men together. We've almost got enough men to attack. But yeah, your friend talked to you today. 
They made peace. I will put Fionn in charge, and the next one will be Joseph Knott. What timeline is this? This is actually the Dance of Dragons. Uh, Marija, I've been tending the wounds of your men. Maesters are most useful. Yes, they are. Yes, they are. We'll take this. It won't take too long. And my liege lord has not asked me to stop. So my sister is ill. Call the physician. Oh, no. Alaric Woods. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did this guy call himself? Ironsmith. Feoden Ironsmith. Makes sense. He was a good, you know, he's a good warrior. You know, he's a good leader of men. It kind of makes sense. Play him on nine stars. And we got it. Uh, they have a prisoner. Roderick Woods. Release him. Yeah, he, he allowed us to attack Roderick Woods because of his rebellion. Because um, they tried to take his lands from him. That allowed us to attack and give us a good opportunity. So let's do that. Have his family put in the dungeons. Take his family to house arrest. Put him in the dungeon. And we got 99% because we have his heir. A favor. Aaron Bolton. Well, Aaron Bolton has helped us a lot. So we'll join. Yeah. We will. Um, one, we'll, we'll help him, whatever he wants to do, and he'll owe us a favor. We'll tack them down here. The Boltons don't know what they're doing. They're just going to stay there, apparently. And there we go, 100%. Glover family. <laughs> We've taken deep wood. That means our lands are completely connected. I'm very, very happy with this. And we'll keep deep wood and Bear Island, I think. We'll give away... Crow's Edge. NG, I'd love to see a new Euron playthrough now that Dragon Binder works. Seal and Bird Lizards as the most evil pirate ever would be great. That's a good, okay, good. I'm glad to hear that. Maybe we will. Next time then, I will remember that one and put that down as a choice for the council to vote for for our next one. But we need someone to take this land. Now my son, obviously, he's going to inherit our own land, so I'm not going to give it to him. In our council, let's a quick look. In our council, we have as Ramsey and Donald. Uh, Ramsey, maybe we could give the land to him. He's married to this low-born girl. He's got a son and stuff. Let's have a quick look who is actually in court. Any names that stand out to me? We've got some Glovers. That's because they're in jail. <laughs> maybe we should let them go. Eh, maybe we should keep them just in case so he doesn't attack me. I will, I will give it to that Ramsey guy. Congratulations, Mr. Ramsey. We will give you Crow's Edge. What's your name? Flynn. I like it. Ramsey Flynn. Some nice little names there. There we go. I've got the advisor back as well. So we're back on the council. We're stronger than we were before. And our lands are completely connected. How could this have gone any better? The Justice is doing a superb job. Go to the castle. Get my vassals to love me. And yeah, my liege lord never asked me to stand down. So that's good. I would like Dragon Point one day. My lord, I believe Lady Hara has been in your custody for too long. I accept. I'll take the gold. We'll take that gold. We're fine with that. If they're willing to pay, pay the iron price. Wait, that's not that's not our tradition, is it? Oh, well. Uh, oh, no. King and male of the Iron Throne has declared the Iron Throne du jour war of the north. So, Mela, now that he's released, he's like... Damn those two paramounts. I cannot be shown as this weak. If, if I die, this is how people remember me as the man who lost the north and the rock. I cannot have this. So he's decided to go take it for himself. He doesn't have a dragon. But he probably does have some people with him who have dragons. So yeah, 29,000 men. We have 27,000 men. How is this going to go down? Support the throne. We support the king in the north. The king in the north, everyone. Please chat. Chant King of the North. Give the King of the North your energy. The King of the North. We have to give him all of our energy so we can succeed. It's the only way. Ransom those kids. Yeah, they're fine. They're fine. Um, but what's the Tyrell? The Tyrells are not getting involved. So we just have the uh, the Stormlands, which he controls, basically. If the Riverlands and the Vale have to, have to help, basically, because they're at war, it looks like. Edwin's, yeah, they're at war with each other. There we go. The king in the north. Thank you. Send in the troops. He's been excommunicated for not helping the king. The king was very angry with the Tyrells. How many men does that give him then? 25. This could be a pretty good fight. 25,000 men from the south versus 28 from the north. 
And Kragen's a good leader, but they have dragons down south, so it might be too much. I need treatment for my illness, though. Mr. Ufa, as long as you know what you're doing. Who is the Stark King? <laughs> it's Kragen. I feel better. Great. So Fionn is leading men. We're heading down south. Kragen Stark has told me to lead men down. We got some taxes. Good. Danella Mormont has arrived at my court. Her husband, Locke, has died. Oh, my poor daughter. You're 37. You're 37. They've ended. And what are the Tullys doing? What are, are they staying? Yes. Okay, so the Trident is helping the king in the south. 25, he has 25,000 men himself. Oh, no. That could completely change the whole war. Because that war's over, I'm not sure we could win. I'm not sure that we could win. What's going to happen has been a success during my visit. Perfect. Hopefully we just get lucky and we have some good battles. But if there are dragons about, uh, the war... Oh no! The world is... The wall is under assault. Lord Commander Quarren the Old. Ready the men. I'm sure they can... My small council. My small council. Does Fionn go north? While, they, while our king goes down south, should I go north? I mean, I can't. I have to fight. Should I send my son to go north and help the wall? Or should, is it just snarks and grumpkins up there? What does the small council think? 4,800 men. They got 3,000. They do need a little bit of help, it looks like. Ride to the north. I am the... But this is the north. Damn what? Help them, says Luke John. Any other ideas? I think some people have fallen behind. So if you are falling behind, remember, guys, refresh your stream. Help. These are dark days indeed. Bloody wildlings. The war in the south won't matter if the war falls, my lord. Well, it's only wildlings, so... <laughs> Started watching the stream, so I don't know, but Master of Laws, I'm not particularly committed. Sun to the north. Okay, so everyone's saying go help. Yes. Ready the men. We ride north. So we're going to help the wall fight against them. Dawn is coming. Flint's finger and me. Let's raise our own men. This could weaken us as a place, but they need us. Let's put all our men together and then put the commanders we can give. Probably just my son can go. Burn them all, someone said. I mean, <laughs> um, we're, we're kind of in the Northmen. I don't think Northmen are known for burning people. Unless we get a dragon, maybe. Oh, what happened? Oh. What just happened? What the red, the arbor is here. What is going on? Get the men together. Quickly, get the men together. We must, we must defend our lands. Um, Lionel the Reach died in battle against Lord Florian. So Sir Florian. So we've been, had a, there's a surprise attack by the Redwine family. And they've killed some of our men. How dare they? How dare we got to defeat these guys first. Now 4,000 men now. Why did, didn't I tell them all to stop? I'm, so, I'm sorry, I must have not told them to stop. Sorry, that was my own fault. 600. We don't have enough men to take them down. Damn. Well, we just gotta go. We just gotta go. We leave this to the king. This is for the king of the north. We leave that to him to come back and help us. Um, we have to just go up north. What was the rest doing? We got 23,000 men. We got 12,000 men here from the Iron Throne. Oh dear. Oh dear. Keep going, my men. They got more men coming, possibly. Yeah, almost 5,000 men have come here. And my lands are weak because we just took out all the men. Well, some of the men inherited those lands. Okay, go, go, go. 21st of March. We'll increase the speed. And my lord, news from battle. All realm We have reports that your liege, Kragon Stark, has been killed. While leading troops in the twins. No, guys. Kragen Stark, our king in the north, was killed by Sir a just an a hedge knight. He was killed by a hedge knight when he was fighting the Trident's men. Elmo Tully's men killed him. Oh, no. And so now we have a baby king of the north. King Ben, five years old. Oh, no. The king in the north. The king, why, why do I feel like this is like deja vu? <laughs> oh no, and 
The Glovers are the region. That might be good. That might be good for me. Okay, with this king, we're going to have to send men. We don't have enough men to help up north, though, it looks like. We've got 4,500 men. This has all gone badly wrong. We might just lose. A daughter was born to my son, Melian Mormont. 5,000. There's 21,000 men there, but there's 18,000 just over here. And they did win the battle. They were at 13%. Can we keep winning? Can he do it, Mela? Damn you. Damn you. You killed our king. You killed our king. It's a... Ugh. Damn Kragen Stark. He couldn't do it. Oh, 13th. I'm still the advisor, though, to the lands. Maybe I could try and become... Ah, huh. we could try and become a regent, possibly. Flint's all with us. Let's go. Um, Theon, no, I'm leading men down south. Let's send Joseph Knott and Galbert. So Joseph Knott is going to lead the men to try and help, but there's too many. There's too many wildlings. 4,000. We can't defeat 4,000 wildlings. It's impossible. Even with this, 3,900. We need more men. We need more men before we can go further north into the wall. I've been ex... Okay, this high septum excommunicated Lord Paramount Gowen Tyrell. After, I guess, the young died. The Shield Isles. Is House Stark doing well if the baby would die? Yeah, if he dies, it's like, a, it's like another kind of branch of the Stark family. So the Starks aren't doing too bad. Um, and actually, Bernard Stark died... Yeah, against Sunderland family. Okay. Travers bring rumors of fire and blood. They say Ribeiro Valeros now has tamed Silverwing. Okay, so this man from, uh, I think, Valeria. Yeah, the Painted Valleys. Okay, okay. Good for them. Good for them. You know? We're minus 16%. That we are beating the Wildlings 51%. They just go into attack. No, they're going over this way. They're going to go help up north. If we can get enough men, we will go and help. But we also got to keep an eye on the war down south. 15,000 men. 7,000 over. We still got a big chunk of men. Uh, my spy master was killed, which is not good. And we need a new one. Hofenori. He likes us. So let's go for Hofenori. He can be the spy master. And if we have any more men. And we've got 600 more men we could get. But I think we're just going to leave it for now. There's a lot of men around, but just not enough to take down the wildlings attacking the wall. Uh, Lawrence Flint is no longer a participant in the King Hal's invasion of the Night's Watch. I think the North is attacking. Has the North joined it? Yes, so the new King, King Ben, uh, with his regent, basically the Glovers, have decided we will also defend the Night's Watch. They also have decided to attack. There's a new Lord Commander. Lord Commander Laurent Lorch is the new Lord Commander. So they don't need us, actually, right now. There you go. They don't need us. The North has joined it, so we're no longer needed. And all the armies disappeared. <laughs> Defeat. No, minus 44%. No, the major army has been defeated. If, why? There's the Dornish coming up now. Turbocharge. Hi, how are you doing? Welcome aboard. Things are not going well for the North. Not going well indeed. Uh, son, you're in more kids? You've had three kids so far. Have another son. Another son would be good. Um, ooh, Lord Paramount Kermit has been excommunicated by the king. The king is having everyone excommunicated, apparently. He's still not got married either, and he's tamed his own dragon. Though he doesn't seem to have it. Who is your dragon, Mela? Huh. That's weird. Nope, no dragon. Um, okay, he just got it just then. That's why he's gotten Tricus, a 19-year-old dragon. Okay, so that was why I couldn't see it. He literally just got it when I did it. Hmm, okay. The excommunication seems a bit common in the newest mod version. I would agree. It does seem like people get excommunicated quite a lot. Um, but yeah, call for the physician at once. I heard things are going well. Uh, it's going, you know, actually for us, like for the Mormons, we've taken over the High Lordship up here and uh, the Deepwood. But for the North, for us, the North might be put back underneath the Iron Throne. We're minus 40%. Unkempt buffoons in the King's ranks. How long have you all been watching NG's videos as Plasma Grunt? 
Finally made it to your stream. Thank you, Gegitz. Glad you could join. My mood swings mostly from good temper to rough have made my courtiers fear me a little bit too much. All hell is loose. How can I rely on the generals when their understanding of warfare is so lacking? Son, you need to learn how to be a Mormont. We're unyielding. Here I stand, son. You need to learn that. Here we stand. And he did learn it. Good job, son. See, he's a good, he's a good son. Around the Bolton series. Now, the Veil is now in a slight civil war. Which I don't think is going to help us much anyway. But the Trident's only got 9,000 men left. Huh. And we still got 15 and 5,000. If they can get back north and help. <gasps> no. They were captured. The king captured the Carwin family. And they betrayed us then. Those... Oh. I mean, they were captured. You know, you got to give them some credit there. 9,000 men here in my lands. I can't... I haven't got the men. We don't have the men to defeat them. King, you need to bring your men back north and defeat these guys. Where's your main army? What happened? Okay, there they are. 15,000. They keep disappearing. Where'd they go? Where did those 15,000 men go, guys? Um, the 15,000 men just disappeared. They need to go back north with these 5,000 and defeat this army of the Iron Throne. He's just gaining war score all the time. He's going to gain more and more war score. Ugh. Okay, we delete that. He attacked with... Why did you attack with such a small army? This young boy is going to kill us all. Ben Stark, you fool. The regent is now the priest, Jonos. Damn, priest. I mean, actually, I like priests. I'm a zealous man. So, good old priest. He's obviously giving him good advice, isn't he? And 12... Oh, all well, the 12,000 men were going to then go and take uh, Winterfell. There's 11,000 up here. I've been reading the legends, and it claims that death is not something a true believer should be afraid of. Hmm, would I? The gods forgive me. What is then the afterlife, though? I'm paranoid, yeah. I think I'm paranoid, so I'm not sure what is in the afterlife. So I'm like, I don't even know what's in the afterlife. What could it be? Uh, Danella Mormont needs... She's kind of good at intrigue. She hates fun, but she likes money. So, I mean, she likes learning, but we can't choose learning. So we have to go for money then. There you go, girl. There you go. The highest one we can afford... Five years? Damn. Okay, so that's done. King Ben, the buffoon. This guy made me watch CK2. Ah, oh, glad to hear. I mean, I'm assuming you mean me. Made me realize the game was boss. The game is boss. And we're minus 96%, guys. It is over. And, you know, Craig and Stark, he brought us the glory... And then died, and our dreams were shattered. And there we go. New Lord Commander, Martin Sloan. It all came crashing down, didn't it, guys? 96% still. Whilst leading the men, uh, King Ben, well, we lost the Battle of Deepwood against him. Okay, I thought it meant we, like, Ben was killed or something leading the men. I was a bit confused just then. We're 96%. There's no way we're going to bring this back. The King in the North has lost. And we're at 100%. There we go. It is over. No more Kings of the North. <laughs> no more Kings of the North anymore. <laughs> oh, well. And there we go. Lord Paramount Ben Stark. He's seven years old. What a, what a little boy he is. What a little boy. Let's see. Factions. Start a faction. Liege loyalists. Overthrow it. Depose the Lord Paramount. Nothing there really helps us. So we're not really going to do anything with that. Any plots we could do. Rescue them? No. Eh, we'll leave it for now then. Our guy will be a loyal vassal right now. But we still have the war for the Night's Watch. Which we're currently winning. But who knows how long that will be. The North, though, is back underneath the Iron Throne. Mela is gaining his respect back. He's gaining his honor back. All that's left is the Rock. Can he take back the Lannisters' lands? They're married to a Reign, and she's a formidable fighter. Look at her. Wow. Wow. Uh, Mela the Targaryen is doing a good job, isn't he? He's done a pretty good job, actually. You have to admit that. You have to admit that. He's done something maybe some people didn't think he could do. 
If we go down south a bit there, we have obviously Dawn. Dawn, there was not part of the Iron Throne there before anyway, so that's why I didn't include that. But I mean, you could also take Dawn, you know. Qu Prince Corin the Cunning. There you go. Let's increase time then, seeing as peace has now come to the lands. Are we going to send the 11,000 north now? So we can save the Night's Watch. 88% right now. Shouldn't take too long. Martin Sloan will be victorious. The Lannister should really have their lands taken from them if the king gets the rock back. You'd expect that, but then again, that was his father. It wasn't him. So maybe he'll blame his father for what happened. Um, and his father's dead. Harold Aaron has died. Bedridden and infirm. He was known as the Fat. Um, his son did not take over. Who's taken over then? Who is the new Lord Paramount? We have Lord Paramount Jonathan Aaron of Joffrey. So that was the first son. Yeah, why didn't I click that already? Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Uh, news in King's Landing, they say. New dragons entered the world. Uh, Jacaris Valyrian has now got his own dragon. Tyrosh, that's an interesting name. He's got married to just a lowborn girl. Good for him. Forgive me. It's all right. Okay, don't know what's going on in the chat right now. You guys talk some weird things sometimes. I have no I can't keep up. I can't keep up what's going on in the chat sometimes. It's just too much for me most of the time. Uh, Shadow Maul's been a success. He's got them to like us more. Uh, Northern Traditions, of course, to the Dreadfort. You know, we are allied together after all. And uh, we'll get you to improve relations with these guys. Because they still don't like me. I don't think. That was a quick look. Yeah, the Knots don't like me completely just yet. He fought bravely. Harmond Marsh. I always enjoy the level of RP NG users instead of it just being about winning. Um, Harmond Karstark, who's not really a Karstark. He's a different type of Karstark. Um, and so he won in the end, though. Congratulations. Lag. Yeah, apologies, guys. If you do find there's a bit of lag, please refresh. The stream is having a bit up and down time. Um, and I said that before. It kind of went up, then it went better, then it went bad again. And now it's gone bad again. Then it went good. Then now it's bad. But yes. And in fact... We probably won't stream for much longer, guys. We'll probably only stream for maybe uh We'll probably only stream for a little bit longer, unless the lag continues, then I'll just finish now. Because otherwise it'd be impossible. Um Okay, Medgar Mormont. He likes diplomacy. Duty? Let's go duty for him. Let's give him duty. Stream bad for anyone else. Okay, lag, lag. <laughs> Okay, everyone's saying lag right now. So what I'll do... I think what we'll do... Um, guys, because anyway, I'm going to end in like 10 minutes anyway. And because everyone's having a lot of lag, what I'm going to do is I'm going to finish off here. So guys, I hope you enjoyed. We'll continue the Mormont story next time. So if you come back next time next week, we will continue the story of Fionn Mormont and his family. Hopefully we can uh, try and take the North back. And uh, well... I mean, do we really want to try and take the north? I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, also, on Saturday, so tomorrow, the stream is going to be possibly Hearts of Iron 4 or Surviving Mars. It's going to be one of the two, and Sunday will be the other one. So the next two days is going to be Surviving Mars and Hearts of Iron 4. So I've changed the schedule a little bit for this weekend because I've really been enjoying those two games. I'd like to play some more with you guys in the stream. So that'll be the plan for this weekend. Next time though we'll be playing. We'll be back with the Mormons. I like this. I like what we've made here. It's a nice little place. Uh, maybe we'll take over the north. Maybe we'll try and become independent. Obviously it depends who we are. And what type of role play they'd like to do. To get more powerful. So we'll have to just wait and see who that is. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, it ain't so bad. I know but I was going to end in like 10 minutes anyway. So it's fine. <laughs> it's fine. Don't, leave. don't worry. I was going to end in like 10 minutes anyway. So it was, it's not a big deal. Um, plus, you know, my partner, she's sick at the moment, so I need to go make sure she's okay. But yeah, guys, 